Hey guys, it's Marky here with Ruby's Quick Tip of the Week. Today we're going to be talking about I don't know. What we're talking about is the response, I don't know, to any one of your customer's questions. Regardless of whether or not you actually have the answer to a question, saying I don't know is counterproductive and your customers lose trust in your ability to help them. When has I don't know ever been helpful to anyone? I don't know. I have no idea. Spoiler alert, it hasn't. Despite your commitment to your customer service experience, you don't have a crystal ball that's going to let you know the answer to every single question that any customer at any point in time can have. But the good news is there are a ton of alternatives that don't focus on what you can't offer your customer in that moment, but instead emphasizes what you can do to help them. Drum roll, please. I'd be happy to help you with that. John would be the best person to answer that question. Let me try his line for you. Even if your caller doesn't get the answer to their question on that phone call, you're building trust and rapport with them by using the tools that you have to get their question to the person who's going to answer it best. And they know that when they're talking to you because you're telling them that that's what you're doing. So switch it up from I don't know and start employing better ways to answer questions you don't actually have the answer to. Happy calling and we'll see you next week. Bye guys.